Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome to my office. You wish to turn me into a girl? Oh, I see the photo. Welcome, Sebastian, pour him a cup of tea. I said, pour him a cup of tea. Thank you. So, what is your request? Ah, you wish to try to be one of the Phantom Hive team, huh? You wish to be a part of our... Oh, you wish for me to do your hair. That's an odd request. So you're considered a magician, and you want to turn me into a girl, and you want me to do your hair. Well, since you are helping me to solve the mystery and apprehend the criminal, I suppose I could oblige. But it'll cost you. Your soul, perhaps. Sebastian, bring me the hairbrushes. Thank you. Your hair looks filthy. Honestly, it's a mess. I mean, I suppose I could do something with it. But honestly, this is a job for Sebastian, not for me. What's in it for me? What's in it for me? Oh, so you'll also pay me too, huh? Alright. I suppose I could try. Hair looks. Sebastian, put that down. Freaking idiot. Ah. <laughs> uh, sorry for my butler's incompetence. My hair is frayed. What do you mean it's frayed? Of course, of course, of course. No, it's just Finny put some fire on my hair when he was cooking after the meal was served. <sighs> Seems like you have a lot of frizz. Guess I'll have to use some better product. Let's see here. Alrighty. Hmm. Excellent. Now that that's in your hair. Oh, what was that? You want to try some Ceylon cinnamon tea? I think we had it imported. It's not very, um... Not, not really the best tea. I don't know why you would want that one. I don't know why you would want that one. What the hell? Okay. So you would like for me to curl your hair? I suppose I could. But it would take overnight. Are you going to stay here at the Phantom Hive Mansion overnight? Fine. Oh, Sebastian, put that away. We don't need any cats in here. You know I'm allergic to cats. <laughs> Alright. Put this... In a box. So tell me. 
of your journeys as a magician, I suppose you could say, what did you find interesting? Oh, I suppose Agni does have some businesses in India. That's very interesting. That you went on tour there. Would you like to play a game of chess later? You're one of my only friends that I just made. Oh, Sebastian, put that away. I'm not a little boy anymore. All right, your hair's done. Suppose she probably puts a little more light in here. Really want to use some of those Yankee candle, was it? You said you were from the future. What's it like in the future? Bright as cars. Interesting. I'd like to try a car one day. All right, that's enough. Have you had enough of your tea? Well, I suppose I could oblige with one more request. <laughs> no, I won't cross-dress as a girl. Sebastian, bring over the um, list of contenders for our next event. Thank you. Oh, sorry. Just my cat apparently likes needing pillows. Oh, my cat. It's not even my cat. Good lord. Your hair... Looks a little bit like it could use a good haircut. Good haircut and maybe some clips. Just put some clips in here. Clip here. Clip there. Alright, you're all done. Oh, it looks terrible. Well, I don't care. Have a nice day. If you ever come back to the Phantom Hive Mansion, make sure to bring an invitation next time. It's nice to meet you. If I see you again, Sebastian, escort them out, please. The hallway, the exit is to your left. Good day, sir. Or madam. <laughs>